Hi everybody, I'm and nope, one more time. I'm sorry. <laughs> hey guys, it's me, Ali Brooke, and I'm here with P3 Star, and I'm gonna answer some of your questions. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> this is funny. <laughs> my best friend wants to get a really ugly tattoo. Should I say my honest opinion? <laughs> I'm sorry, that's really funny. Um, yes. I, yes. I have had friends in the past tell me, it's not, not tattoo, but, you know, tell me my outfit, no, girl, what are you thinking? And I wore it anyways, and I look back and I'm like, wow, Ali, why? Why didn't you listen? Um, and a tattoo is permanent. Like, that's on your skin. It's not like an outfit where you can just change it, you can move on. That tattoo's there to stay, honey, so I think it's worth every penny telling your friend the honest truth. Oh, this is a cool question. What's the secret technique to singing opera? That is a great question, as I already said. <laughs> um, wow, I'm not an opera teacher. Um, it's all about control and vibrato. Um, there's something really beautiful about opera and its style. You can recognize it as soon as you hear it. Phantom of the opera is there inside my mind. Ah. Hope I could demonstrate. <laughs> oh, and the diaphragm. That's another thing. The diaphragm. Right here. The diaphragm helps when singing opera. You need a lot of air, a lot of control. So, okay. Oh my God. <laughs> Sorry. This is a bit shameful, but I'm really interested in my friend's ex. What should I do? Oh shoot. Dang, that's a hard one. Um, oh, that, that, that's tough. Cause you don't want to, you know, ruffle any feathers, especially with your friend. Um, number one thing is friendships first. Loyalty, my answer's just gonna be talk to her. If she's really your friend and you're really her friend, you should approach her and just say, girl or whoever, I love you. Uh, I gotta be honest with you, this is how I'm feeling. And who knows, maybe she'll actually support it. There are some people who I know, some of my friends, they've kind of like dated each other's, you know, Boyfriends, or not boyfriends, but you know, exes. <laughs> Make that clear. <laughs> and the other person was fine with it. And then I'm sure some other people aren't. So as long as you just talk, I think you should be good. Okay, oh, that's, that's sad. Okay, my relationship sucks. We live together and I don't have anywhere else to live. I'm so sorry, come stay with me. Should I stay or should I go? Should I stay or should I go? Sorry, I had to. I had to sing that. And that song always reminds me of Stranger Things. Um, anyways, not to get off track. I always say, don't be unhappy. Life is too short to settle. And if you don't feel like you're getting that respect that you deserve, and you're not getting that attention, that love and care, girl or boy, whoever you are, I'm rooting for you. I think that you should do what makes you happy. And if you're not happy being in the, in, in the relationship, then it's probably best to walk away. And it's so hard and scary and it's never easy. But sometimes we have to make tough decisions in life in order to grow and become better people. So I'm wishing you all the best. Thank you guys so much for having me. I really, 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 Hope that I was able to help you. Thank you so much, P3 Star, for having me. I love you guys.